This is a model of a right knee from the back. So this side here being the center of your knee, this being the outside, this being the bottom, this being the top. Your knee consists of four bones, number one being your tibia, which is the major part of your shin, second one being your fibula, which is the smaller supporting bone on the outside, third being your femur, or your thigh bone that goes from here all the way up to your hip, fourth being your kneecap, which is the bone that's encased inside the tendon of your quadriceps right here. Now your knee is held together by four major ligaments. A ligament is a structure that attaches bone to bone. So the first ligament we'll look at is your MCL, or your medial collateral ligament. You'll see there's this thick tendon or band right here. Now, that will prevent any sideways strain on your knee. You have your, it's equivalent on the other side, called your LCL, little ligament right there. And then crossing in the center, you have your anterior cruciate ligament and your posterior cruciate ligament that are here and here. They will prevent forward back shear in the knee to help hold it together. Now you also have what's called a meniscus, which are these two cartilage C-shaped discs that they act as shock absorbers for the knee and help the congruent flexion extension movement to happen with these nice rounded bones on this top flat part of your tibia. Now there are a number of muscles that cross the knee. The major ones are your quadriceps, which are your bigger part of your thigh up the top here. Quadriceps have four muscle groups to them. Your, this is the outside muscle, the inside muscle, the one right up the center. This one actually does cross your hip joint. And then there's one buried underneath that you can't see. You also have what's very important in the knee is your IT band, which comes from a muscle well up into your hip. But the tendon does come right down in and attach on the side here and will have implications pulling onto your kneecap. Other muscles are your hamstrings, which will be cut off on this guy, but they run down the back of your back of your thigh and attach down into the back of your knee here and your calf muscles or your gastrox which come from your from your heel up and cross over here there are uh, this little guy that's cut off is called your popliteus which most people have never heard of but when it gets tight or dysfunctional it can mimic um, meniscus injuries and create a fair amount of pain back here